Now, anything you produce that's long form is cut down to very, very short form. You find the, you most from they that. find the most controversial clips they can Andrew, on purpose. I'm saying what happened. Look, you can talk to girlfriends of yours. If it's consensual between you and another woman, you can do what you like, right? It's when you say it in public, it's the influence that this kind of thing has on young men. It's who are, by the way, they're intrigued by you. They're fascinated, right? So my point to you is, given that you know it can be misunderstood, do you regret saying things like this on camera where it can be disseminated by less intelligent young males who think that is actually what they should be doing to women? So now, with great fame, would I, now that I'm famous, yes. do I say things the same way as I did back before I was famous? Right. As you become famous, you have to be a lot more careful with how you say things. This was the excuse that was put out by the big tech companies. Excuse. Oh, but generally, I don't really agree with no platforming people. Yep. But I think what's interesting talking to you is it seems to me like you have gone on a bit of a journey of self-awareness about the impact of some of the stuff you said in the past.